Hi there. Valentine's Day is coming up really soon and if you have a special date with a boyfriend or a girlfriend or a maybe future boyfriend or girlfriend coming up this Valentine's Day and you're not sure what kind of look you want to do and you want to do something a little bit more dramatic, a little bit sexy, why not try this? This is a sexy pink and kind of red smoky look. Now let's get started and I'll show you what to do. First of all, you have to take a base colour. Uh, my base colour is 330 from Inglot. It's just pretty much a skin tone. Um, whatever matches your own skin tone. I'm using this blending brush from Sigma. Use a good big brush because you're going all over the eye. Covering the whole eye and just under the eye for an even look. Now we're going to take, this brush is from Front Cover, it's a rounded shader brush and we're taking Sushi Flower from MAC. Now with MAC eyeshadows, the trick with them is to pat them in. If you rub, you kind of rub them away, so you have to kind of pat them onto your eye. Just to the inner third of the eye. And then we're going to take this gorgeous red shimmery colour from Inglot on a point brush it's called, but a pencil brush I suppose. You can add a drop of Geraldine onto the colour. And this will really intensify the colour as you apply it. See the difference that makes? And it really brings out the kind of shimmer that's in the eyeshadow. Don't worry if it's a little bit messy, we still have to work it out and blend it in. Now take the brush that you used with the Sushi Rose and just sort of blend these two colours together. And next of all, we're going to take, we're taking Oil Slick from my Urban Decay Urban Ammo Palette. And we're taking a black eyeliner, a good coal eyeliner, one that's nice and soft. And this one is Bad Gal from Benefit. And we're just going to do a point, sort of like that, sort of like you're starting your eyeliner, but just a nice point. And then bring it around to about the inner part of your eye. Not much further though. Try and get it into a little point just on the inside. And I know this looks a bit crazy but this will guarantee that the colour really is intense and stays very well. So just take a small little pencil brush with your oil slick and work this in and around the eyeliner you already applied. And as you can see it's going on really really dark and intense. And then all you have to do is blend. Take your uh, brush that you have that you used first for your base colour and use this just to blend the outside part of the black. This will soften it up a little bit. And don't forget if you make any mistakes, take your concealer brush and just tidy up any mistakes that you make if you go out too far. We're going to take our sushi flower again and just bring this up and blend it into it. Now, once your eyeshadow is to your liking, just take a small brush, this is an eyeliner brush, Take a little bit of your black and just bring it right under the eye and join up with the outside bit. 
almost to the inner corner, but not quite. Then we're just going to tidy up the inside. You don't want any eyeshadow color here yet. And next of all, we're going to take, this is just a tiny mini blending brush. Take a little bit of white eyeshadow or whatever color you want to use as your highlight. You could go for something a little bit more shimmery since this is a date, but I think it's already pretty dramatic as it is. And just take a little bit more of the white and put it on the inside corner. This will just open up the eye. And now we're going to take our eyeliner again. And we're not going to go for anything too harsh. So just line the eye right across with your pencil liner. Right into the inside, just like that. And then take your black brush again because you want to make sure the outside is blended well. You want to have a nice soft line. Now, all you need is some mascara. My mascara is from La Roche Posay. This mascara is for sensitive eyes. And of course, seeing as this is a date look, you could go ahead and stick on some false lashes. You could curl your lashes with an eyelash curler as well. Now we're going to go for lips. I've already put on blusher and contour. Um, and for this look, because it's Valentine's Day, you really want to have really kissable lips. You want whoever you're out on your date with to just be dying to kiss your lips. So you want your lips to look big and full and juicy. So we're going to do a little bit of um, shading and highlighting on the lips. So what we're going to do is take, just take any brush and take your shading colour. Mine is a taupe. And just take that under the bottom lip to create a false shadow which will make your bottom lip look big and full and juicy and then we're going to take a highlight we're not taking our white we're taking a shimmery highlight and this will just go on the top And this will make your top lip look big and full. And then we're going to go in with a bit of colour. Um, this palette is a palette that I actually made yesterday. Um, it used to be a Isadora eyeshadow palette that I had that all the eyeshadows broke and fell apart. So I took it and of course I covered the Isadora with little diamonds that I found. And I had these lipsticks that I had actually lost the lids for. And... I melted them in. They were proper foam lipsticks. One of them is actually this one here from, I think it's Rimmel, Lasting Fix Pink Power Lipstick from Rimmel. And that's this one here. And as you can see, the colour doesn't really change when you do it. And I just melted them in. And of course the base got a little bit warped, but who cares, it's my palette. Um, so now I have five new colours on this gorgeous little set, which is actually very similar to my Inglot palette, my Inglot lip palette, um, this one here. It holds five as well and has a little mirror. They're just slightly different, but very similar. And so we're going to take our colour. I'm going to go for this slightly pink. This colour is kind of sheer, it's not too deep. We're going to mix it with a little bit of the lighter pink, which is this one. These two colours are from an SBC set I got a while back. And you want to make sure you get right out to the edge of your lip. If you have small lips, take a lip liner and you can make your lips a bit bigger. And then you can take a gloss 
if you want. You can make them just a little bit shiny. Boys don't exactly like kissing it, but it always looks good. And there you have it. That's our glamorous, sexy Valentine's look. Um, if you like this video, please subscribe to see the rest of my videos. And come back for more tutorials with me. And I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye.